Hello friends, I am Sanjay Gupta. In this tutorial, I am going to explain functions and pointers related interview questions and answers. First question, tell the definition of function. Answer is, a function is a set of instruction which is implemented to perform a particular task. Next question, how many types of functions are there in C? Answer is, there are two types of functions. First is predefined function. Second is user defined function. Next question, tell the needs of user defined functions. Answer is, to implement function oriented approach, we need user defined functions. For reusability of code, we need functions. For debugging, or we can say debugging becomes easy and fast with the help of functions. Compilation and execution time is reduced if we use predefined or user defined functions. Next question, how many parts are there in every function? Answer is there are three parts in every function. First is declaration, second is calling, and third is definition. Next question, what is prototype of a function? What information it tells? Answer is prototype means functions declaration. It tells return type, function name, and arguments type. Next question, what is the difference between call by value and call by address? Answer is, in call by value, values of actual arguments are passed to formal parameters, whereas in call by address, addresses of actual arguments are passed to formal parameters. In call by value, if we change values of formal parameters, then values of actual arguments do not change, whereas in call by address, values of actual arguments change. Next question, can we define a function inside another function? Answer is no, we cannot define a function into another, but we can call a function into another function. Next question, can a function return multiple values using call by value? Answer is no. Next question, if we don't define any return type before function name, then what will be the default return type? Answer is int. Next question, if we want to return multiple values from a function, what mechanism we have to use? Answer is call by address. Next question, can we have variable with same name in different functions? Answer is yes. Next question, is it necessary in C to define every function after main? Answer is no, we can define functions before main. Next question, can we call a function any number of times? Answer is yes. Next question, is it necessary to call every function which we have defined? Answer is no. Next question, what is a pointer? Answer is, pointer can store address of a variable. Next question, what is the difference between ampersand and asterisk operator? Answer is, ampersand is known as address of operator, whereas asterisk is known as value at address. Next question, what is the size of pointer? Answer is, 2 bytes if we are using 16 bit compiler. Next question, what is the difference between a pointer 
and pointer to pointer answer is a pointer stores address of a variable whereas a pointer to pointer stores address of a pointer next question can we declare any type of pointer answer is yes we can declare any type of pointer next question tell some uses of pointer answer is it allows us to implement call by address and dynamic memory allocation next question what is recursion answer is when a function calls itself in its definition then it is called recursion next question what is the difference between iteration and recursion answer is iteration means implementation of loop whereas recursion means calling of a function in itself thank you